Welcome back. This is The Circle Live. We're talking about relationships once again. Oh. Specifically a frustrating conundrum we may have heard from some of our friends or family. Why her and not me? Mm. You stick it out, give him all the best years, only for him to wipe up the very next woman. Mm. At some My point, God. lines were crossed, but where? <laughs> Our next guest calls himself the relationship cardiologist Ooh. and says he has some advice that may surprise you. Please welcome author, speaker, and relationship coach, Christopher Reed. Oh, wow. Come through. Thank you. How you doing, good. sir? I'm good. Thank good, you. good. Yeah. Thanks so for being Christopher here. Christopher Reed as in Superman. Yeah. <laughs> that was Reeves, but yeah. more like from Kid and Play. That's true. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Reeves. My God today. <laughs> um, well, we're going to see if you can be the Superman on this here next question. Before we get into the topic, though, where did we get the name cardiologist? Why that terminology when it comes to relationships? Um, everybody actually calls me Doc Reed. Mm -hmm. uh, it's my nickname, and I get to the heart of the matter. I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna okay, okay. waste time with a bunch of fluff, you know, when it comes to relationships, especially dealing with women, because I'm not gonna waste y'all time. Mm -hmm. and, oh, and when women are making mistakes out here, um, not in your best interest, then I'm gonna come, and then I'm gonna write a prescription, and I'm gonna help you. Oh, okay. that's what, okay, got it, right, got it. Good, but we, we, gonna, we gonna get into the meat of things. Let's get into the subject of why he married her instead of you. Now, if you remind your, your man, not me, of your intentions, uh -huh. will he eventually be on the same page as you? Um, absolutely not. No, it, it doesn't work that way. Uh, you should never chase a man. You shouldn't pursue a man. Now, I may get myself in some trouble oh, in, yeah. in this day and age that might not be popular, but when I look at myself, like I've been married 25 years, mm -hmm. right? And I talk to other men, Congrats. you know, about what made the difference. It wasn't the one who chased them, mm -hmm. right? It was the one who said, listen, these are my standards. If you want me, this is what you have to do. Mm -hmm. Now, this is just my background. I look at Scripture. Scripture says, and y'all know this, when a man finds a wife, he finds what? A good oh, thing. come on, somebody. Uh -huh. Now, sure I, have, to the good I have Scripture dyslexia. I have to flip it around. So I have to say, it doesn't say when a woman finds a husband, okay? That would be backwards. And it starts with your value. If you don't realize your value, ladies, none of this works because you won't have the confidence mm -hmm. to execute it, mm. you know? So y'all got some bling bling up here. When you saw them diamonds, uh, they wasn't begging you to take the ring mm -hmm. because if they did, you probably think, well, that's cheap, ain't it? It's some cubic zirconia type mess. Mm -hmm. No, you, you wouldn't want that. Same way with a woman. You have to know your value and we as men respond to that. Wow. All right, sounds okay. good to me. So if a woman is, is, is willing to leave at any, I mean, at the sight of any indiscretion, okay. does she usually end up with the man? If she's like, listen, I don't like that. I don't like what you said. I don't like how you do things. Listen, I don't like you, you being on the phone all late with other people. You're going in the other room. You're texting. I don't like it. I'm out of here. Mm -hmm. Will she usually end up with the man? Well, I say this, that you do have to be willing to lose a man to keep him. Okay, now what do I mean by that? And I'm not saying that any little thing he does that you're going to leave, but you have to have those standards to the point where he knows once he gets to the point of wasting your time, mm -hmm. because one thing I hear nowadays is, you know, guys are saying we're building, okay, but They'll be building for five years. Yeah, that's what are we building? A house, condominiums? What are we building? Mm -hmm. Like my daughter tells me, uh, they say now, um, are you down for the come up? No, oh, yeah. I, I, I don't know, right. what, what, what is that? That sounds like Basically, waste. Let's work it all the way out. Well, that sounds like, right. Right. no, that sounds like wasting my time. Yeah, okay, got it, got it. Okay, because when you go buy a car, you don't buy it in the factory. No. You don't buy the frame. Right. No, you buy it when it's finished on the showroom floor. Mm -hmm. So how about you come up and then I'll be down? Hello. Mm -hmm. Huh? Get yeah, I like that. Here, somebody yeah. Okay. Shot okay. It right there. I'm just okay. saying. I, somebody asked me last night when I date someone who worked at a, a telemarketing place. I said, what, do I, what can I do with him? 
there's nothing I can do with him. I don't need you to have potential. I need you to have action. Mm. So no, I will not. And, yeah, I'm, and, yeah. and I'm just That's keeping good. it not real. Dating potential. Yeah, I don't want to date your potential, yeah. baby. I yes. want to date your action. Yeah. I want to date you where you need to be in order to even talk to me. Amen. I like that. Yeah, you like that? I okay. love that. All right, he said he likes it. I love it. <laughs> Actually, I love it. Yeah, you're in my wheelhouse oh, now. Right. Come on, Dan. Yeah, Come I like on, that. Dan, I like that. Hey, you said his heart must be infected. I know that sounds nasty. Yeah. It does. Mm -hmm. It does. I'm explaining it. Uh, Doc Reed, what does that mean? Well, it basically just means that does he that needs mean? to have fallen in love with you. Okay, because none of this works if you don't have his heart. That's true. Okay, but here's what I know. The way we as men fall in love is like cooking a frog. Uh -uh. Okay, I know it sounds weird, but you know how to cook a frog? You put a frog in some warm water, all right? You know, he thinks it's a hot tub. But at the same time, you're turning the water up a little bit at a time, and he's cooking. And that's what happens to our heart, okay? We get cooked, and we don't even realize it happened. And oftentimes, it's when you either leave us, now you know this ain't popular, or the idea that you might leave us that makes us realize, I cannot live without I this leave. woman. I, I, I believe you'll I leave. I have left. Okay. The thing is, remember this, okay? Mm -hmm. We're not looking for the woman we can live with, but the woman we cannot live without. Live without. That's yeah. good. That's what my wife did to me. That's she, good. She, and, and that's how she cooked me. And so I'm here. <laughs> 25 years later, you, she's still cooking me. Oh, so that's so that's you came in here done. <laughs> I look done, I look, I look, I look oh charcoal. Oh yeah. But your next point is quite interesting. You say, it's actually not <coughs> quite interesting. This is actually a very good point. I, I think I know where you're going with this one. This is kind of sharp. You say, the less that you do, the more that you get, and you're talking to women. Well, of I course. Agree. I agree okay. with that. Yeah. I, I am an advocate for the woman. I, this ain't no beat up the woman session. Yes, the less you do, the more you get. Because the opposite of that, of that is, the more you do, the less, the less you, you get. And, and let me say this. That's true. Let me say this real quick. That's true. You cannot true. love a man into loving you. Ooh. 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 Yeah. Can Hold somebody that. give him a couple more minutes? We can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. A few more minutes. You cannot love a man into loving you. Wow. So if you remember That's nothing deep. else, remember that. Love that. Wow, well, we loved you. And Don't do have so you much for him. You for more Make information him earn it. on Doc Reed, please uh, go to his uh, website, ChristopherReed.org. Let's give it up for Christopher Reed. Thank you.